everyone, so today I'll be teaching you a Kim tutorial. It's my first of many that are coming up. I will be teaching you how to do a professional bean. So I hope you guys enjoy it. So first I'm going to go select file open and then you're going to select the image you're going to use. Mm -hmm. This one, click open. I'm going to go to view, zoom, 200. Or maybe smaller. A hundred percent. That's fine. I just want to be able to see it and show you guys because I don't have that follow along screen recorder anymore. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do okay, you're going to click the layer, new layer. And then layer name, you don't have to put a name, and transparency, and then click OK, and then you should have two layers in your layers, channels, and paths window. Then you're going to select your path tool, it's right here, and then you're going to select where you would like your beam to go, so I want it here. That's how I want it to start, don't drag anything, just click it, and then you'll get a, a little circle there, and then where you want it to... Um, to bend, so you're just gonna click and hold. Then you're gonna go down, click, hold, one more down, click and hold, click and hold, click and hold. Oh, I just want it to end there, so I'm just gonna click. Okay, then. Make sure that these two colors are white, so I have mine's white, black right there. I'm just going to do white. Okay. And I'm going to go to select. No, I'm sorry, edit. Then stroke path. And then stroke with paint, with the paint tool. And you select, oh, it's paint brush is fine. Um, and then click stroke. You're going to get a white line there. Then after that, you're going to go to filter, alpha to logo, neon, and click it. Oh, my window's back here, that's why it didn't pop. You're going to get a window like this, and then the background color doesn't matter. But the glow color, you can go ahead and select the color you want. Something girlish for Miley. You guys can go ahead and move everything around here, whatever you guys feel comfortable with. That color is fine. Click OK. The background color doesn't matter, and then the pixels, depending how white you want it, you know, it's up to you. Go 35 and then click OK. Okay, and then you should get something like this. And don't worry, you haven't messed up. You're doing fine. When you get back up your layers window, you're going to select the background number one. That's what it should be named. You're going to select delete layer and then your neon tubes you're gonna right click and merge down and then you're gonna go ahead and select your eraser tool and you can select the brush you wanna just delete it with so yeah. it's kinda big I want it big but not too big that's fine See how good it looks. We're just gonna go ahead and erase. I'm gonna go ahead and go down. 
make it seem like it's actually going around her and I think you guys can tell how professional this really looks and it's fairly easy it's not as difficult as you might think I used to think it was really hard but it's actually very simple you just need to get the hang of it there's only two types of people in the world and her foot And there, that's all I wanted to show you guys. So this was an only Disney Stars production. I hope you guys enjoyed this informative tutorial. And and there's my bee. I kind of messed it up at the top, you know, but it looks really professional compared to like photo filter and stuff. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this tutorial. Keep checking back in for updates. And a lot of photo filter tutorials will be coming up soon. So hope to hear from you guys soon. Bye.